So guys, video is not the main content of the page. This issue is really common these days and a lot of people are facing this issue. You can see a lot of pages of your website here in this issue. And not just this, even the bigger issue is it is not consistent. For example, let me show you. This is my Google Search Console account. And I click on this. Now it says affected page only one and then affected page two and then there's no affected page. And then they say affected page two and then zero. So this becomes really confusing if I am facing this issue. A lot of people are also facing this issue. And problem with this issue, video is not the main content of the page. There's not much documentation about this issue. Not a lot of good YouTube videos even. I was researching on this topic and I found there's some big channel which are telling a lot of lies. This is a big channel particularly which has more than 250,000 subscribers. And they say guys, this issue is coming because of a lazy load issue. If you remove lazy load from your videos, this issue will not come. And that's totally BS, guys. This is totally BS. I don't know how this channel are having 250k subscribers. There's some good videos also I found where people are suggesting to add video schema on the pages. And that was a really nice suggestion. But the problem is there's no complete video on YouTube which can solve this issue completely. So I said, okay, after three or four days of research, I say, okay, let me create a video on this topic. And I'm very confident if you watch this video, you can solve this issue. Video is not the main content of the page. I did four days of research and then created this video. I read the script so many times for this video so I can explain you very easily. So yes, please watch this video until the end. I request you because it's really important to understand Google Search Console issues. Then only you can fix them. Otherwise, it is really impossible for you. You'll spend hours and hours looking on the videos. And if you don't understand the issue, you will not be able to fix those issues. And for the people who say on the channel that there's a lot of blah, blah in my videos. So I want to tell you guys, my videos are there to educate you. They're not the easy fix videos. I want to teach you guys in-depth solution of a lot of things. So you can learn something and even you can make some earning from this thing. If you can fix those for clients or your own website. So guys, it's really important. My videos are like this and I really like to make this kind of video that I can really explain technical things in most easy way. So if you're happy with it, let me show you the solution. And guys, some people say there's no solution in the video. Please rewatch this video again. I spent so much time on this video and I applied the solution myself on my website and I got the results 100%. So please rewatch the video if you don't understand the solution. And if you still don't understand the solution, please comment on the video. I answer to all the comments on my channel. So to understand this issue, video is not the main content of the page. We need to look at the three blog posts from Google. So first blog post came in 2022 July, where Google announced the new Search Console video index report. And in this video index report, Google detects videos on your site. And then report shows in how many pages has Google identified a video, which pages were indexed successfully, what are these issues preventing videos from being indexed. And then you can see in Search Console report under coverage that no video index in video index, why video and pages are not indexed. And then you can see multiple issues, unsupported video format, no prominent video on all page, video too large, and there are many issues here. So these are the issues before in the coverage report. Now these issues you can see on dedicated section here, video pages, and when you click on video pages, you see all the pages on which videos are not indexed. And then you see the reason. So now the second post came from Google in 2023, April. And it says simplifying video presentation on Google search results. So you can see here, it is given example of two different blog posts here. You can see when the video is presented on search result, somebody search for a somebody search for something on Google search engine, then this result can be shown. So here you can see the video is shown on the left side and right side there is a title. This blue line is title. And there is some little information about this video and then date. Same thing happens here. You can see the title and then content or some text on left side and video on the right side. So what is the difference between these two blog posts. So the difference is this is a video blog post where the video is main content. The second one is a normal blog post where the video is complementary. Video is not the main content. And now you'll say I just repeated Google that video is not the main content. Don't worry guys, I'm going to explain everything. And before video ends, you're going to understand everything about video is not the main content of the page. This is a video post and this is a normal blog post where the content is on left side and video on the right side. And this is a video page. Just to simplify things, you can say if the page contains only video and some title and some text, that is a video post. And then if a page contains a lot of text like a normal blog post we read and we add the video in the end or somewhere else on the page, then this is not a video page. And then you can see Google says this second format is going away. So the video post which are showing like this before, they show like normal search result in Google search engine. And then comes the third blog post from Google. So this blog post came in 2023 December. We say video mode now is only shows pages where video is main content. And here Google cleared very nicely what is the main content on the page when it's about videos. You can see 
If this search result is coming something like this, you want to see your video index on Google where the video shows and some text shows, which is the title and little information of the video. Then your page should look something like this. You can see this is your page should look like if you want to index the video from your website on Google search engine. And here Google say clearly, here is an example of page where video is the main content of the page. First thing is the video is above the fold. So when somebody load the website, it should show on the first viewport, both for mobile and desktop devices. Second is prominent and the main purpose of page is to watch that video. So when somebody comes to this page, they come here to watch the video or if somebody open the page, the main thing they can do on the page is to watch that video. There should not be too much text so people read text first and then watch the video. No, there should be really, really a video on the page. Let me explain you more. For example, if I go to Google and search for search term, how to roll back downgrade WordPress. You can see there are multiple results here. There's some website links here and then you can see there's some videos here. And for the video result, you can click on view all from here or what you can do, you can just click here videos. And now all the videos will be shown for this search query. And you can see there's so many results here. If I scroll the page, you can see there's so many videos here. And if you notice this thing, all the videos are from YouTube here. Look at here, YouTube, YouTube, all the videos are from YouTube. If I go to last page, like 10th page, you can see this video is also from Facebook, Facebook, Facebook. There's no video from any other website. So what's happening is most of these videos are from social media or from video streaming platforms. Let's go back to the first page and I explain this further. Okay, so we are on the first page and you can see this is a video from my YouTube channel, how to downgrade WordPress in one minute. If I open this video, you can see here's this video. And then I have the blog post on website, which is about the same search topic, how to roll back downgrade WordPress version. And you can see here, there's a lot of text here and then some steps here, some images. And in the end, I added this video here. And you can see the problem here is, first, it's not in the first viewport, and then this video is not completely shown here. And third thing, this is not the main content of the page. This page is a normal blog post page. And here you can see, this is a video page. If somebody comments on this page, the main purpose of this page is to watch this video, not to watch all these side videos. Of course, you can click on the side pages, but by just this page is created to show only this video. And this page is not created to show that video. So what I need to do now is, Move this video up and remove all this text. This page can be a video page. And Google understand, okay, the main purpose of this page is showcase this video. But it doesn't mean that you delete all the text on your existing pages and then you just move the video up and make the video prominent. No. To do this, you need to create the dedicated video pages. Let me explain by this example. For example, Google has this tool, which is this result test tool. You can enter any URL from internet and you can paste in this tool. And if you click on test URL, there's a lot of information about the page. I want to show you this because there's a very important information what we are going to implement in our solution to index our video pages on Google. So you can see now here when I test my YouTube video with this tool, we have this structured data here. First is breadcrumb and then second is videos. So you can see here this is a video page. This YouTube page is a video page. And what I do if I take my blog post here and then test again this tool. And then you can see here this is an article. If we compare from the YouTube blog post, you can see it's a video and here it says article. Structured data is used to show a lot of important information in the page. For example, ratings, when you search in Google search results, sometimes you see the ratings, sometimes you see the prices of the products. So that is all done by structured data. And this is another important thing done by structured data is, you can say this is an article or you can say this page is a video page. Usually Google can understand whether it's a video page or it's an article. Google is really smart. But sometimes what we need, we need to help Google, we need to tell Google, okay, Google, we create this new page, this is a video page. So for that, we need to add the structured data. That's not the compulsory thing, but yes, that really helps. I tried this solution and worked on my website real nicely. So let me show you what you can do to index your videos on Google search engine. I recommend not touch your old blog posts, which are already ranking if you delete all the text and then move the video up and make other changes, what I'll suggest to you. Then maybe your current ranking will go down. Instead, create dedicated video pages. For example, let me show you how we can do that. So go to new and then click on post, new post, or you can create the new post from backend. And guys, no matter which theme you're using, which page builder you're using, the tips I'm gonna give, they apply to everything. For example, I want to create how to roll back downgrade WordPress version. I already have this URL on my website, so I'll change a little bit something. For example, I will add the WordPress, so URL not same. Okay, now to create this page, video page, what I need to do first is, I click on plus icon, in case of Elementor, you can do the same thing. I click on plus here and then I can search here video and then you can say I have multiple options. If it's self-hosted video, you can choose this option. If it's a YouTube video, you can 
choose this option let's choose youtube one okay it's easy for me to create tutorials if i take youtube videos feel free to choose the video hosted on your own website and then enter the video url here and then click on embed you can see the video is added here and then i give a caption how to downgrade wordpress and then then i can type some information about this video so you can see here when somebody come to this page this title here and then the responsive video here this video will look real nice on desktop or on mobile device you know all device that's really important guys and then caption and what is this video about and once done we click on publish and guys this is not a complete solution please wait for the most interesting part just don't go away think like this is a complete solution i know it's taking longer but yes this will really help you out and if you're still watching this video guys i highly recommend you to like the video subscribe to the channel because this video takes a lot of time to create a lot of research is done to create this kind of videos and i would really appreciate if you like the video subscribe to the channel that will really help the channel to grow and please share this video with your friends and show them what kind of videos you're watching how you're improving your knowledge then click on publish the post is created let's click on view post so you can see this is the blog post if somebody come in this page what they see first is the video video is the main content and if i check the mobile version you can see in the first view post the video is fully showing here it's not cutting the edge is not cutting the size is perfect so it's a responsive video which is looking nice on both desktop and mobile devices and it is completely shown in the first view post so this is a video page okay that's the first thing you need to do what else you need to do because remember we have this result here the video schema we need to add the video schema by default it will have a article schema so what we need to do is and we do not need article schema and video schema both the schema together it is good for the pages where you have your blog post and and then you have video in the end but for dedicated video pages which you want to index on google you don't need article schema you just need the video schema so what we need to do is we'll go back here and then for the people who are using rank math we can click here on rank math and then click here on schema and then you can see right now it is a article so i'll click on schema generator and then in the end i'll choose video and then save for this post and then i'll update this and let's do one thing let's check over this new blog post in the rich result test so I'll enter the url and then click on test url and you can see here three items detected some are invalid so you can see here the video tag is added not the article tag you can see in our blog post where the video is complementary we have article tag here but here we have video tag because we change the schema by rank math okay if we click here you can see the issue if we click on this arrow again missing video thumbnail so what you can do you can go back to the blog post and then click here on setting and then then you need to select the feature image here i wish rank math add this feature so if somebody add a video post they by default take the thumbnail from youtube or they can choose any thumbnail from the video but yes for now you can set a feature image i recommend to rank math team they should update this feature in their coming versions just for example i can choose any image this image i chosen and then click on set feature image and then i click on update and guys make sure you select this option show feature image in the post list only but hide it on single post view because if you do not select this option this feature post might show on the top of the page and then video will go down on the page so once you have selected this option click on update okay page is updated i will go back to this test and then i retest the url you can see here our error is corrected now three valid items and then we have video tag successfully added here so by adding video tag we are telling google that this is a video page please index this video in your search result this is not a blog post page the video is complimentary of course google system is really smart even without adding this schema google can understand what is this page about is it a video page or is it a or is it an article page but for now sometimes you can have this issue that's why you're seeing this inconsistency in the results sometimes it shows more pages sometimes it shows less pages because google is not completely able to determine whether this page is a video page or it is a blog page with a video so i recommend you to add this schema here for people who are using yo ss on the website you need to buy a plugin of 79 euros per year to add this kind of video schema how i did by rank math but what i did i created a very simple plugin which you can download from my website and this plugin is like auto run you install this plugin very lightweight and then it will by default add the video schema on your website pages you do not need to buy 79 euros of plugin from yo if you want this is a nice plugin you can buy the plugin but for the people who don't want to buy i just give you option i create this plugin you can download this plugin so once you make the changes how i shown you with title with on video on the top completely showing on both mobile devices and desktop devices and with schema once you have done this your video will be indexed on google and i tested it and this works really fine and guys make sure don't add a video without any sound 
बिकॉज मोस्टली गूगल रीडियो वीडियो बेस्ड ऑन द ऑडियो स्पोकन इन द वीडियो गूगल एंड से वट इज वीडियो अबाउट सो मेक श्योर यू एड ए वीडियो विद द ऑडियो प्लीज लेट मी ऑन कमेंट्स इफ दिस मैथड वर्क फॉर यू एंड प्लीज वेट फॉर फ्यू डेज वेन यू अपलाई दिस चेंजेस एंड इफ यू एनी सेशन प्लीज कमेंट डाउन ब्लू आई रिप्लाई टू ऑल द कमेंट्स ऑन दिस चैनल डोट फिर लाइक द वीडियो सब्सक्राइब द चैनल एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो एंड प्लीज वॉच दिस वीडियो ऑन स्क्रीन इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो हाउ टू मेक यू वेबसाइट इंडेक्स रैंक वन ऑन गूगल सेशन में